Hi there. It's the 29th of March, 2018 in New Zealand. We're always a day ahead of everybody. <laughs> we're forward thinkers. So today we're going to talk about, we're in the second phase of pregnancy. And we're talking about one of the 10 pregnancy skills that dads developed. And today we're going to talk about awareness. So if you read the description of this post, this is one of the big things that dads taught me. It, how exhausting it is to keep up with the changes that have been occurring from the, in the first phase between conception and 12 weeks. And there's just a part of many men who just want to lay it down, lay down the burden. It's just, it just feels like there's this sacrifice. It feels like just exhausting. However, you have to compare human to human what the woman is doing compared to what you're doing. Once fathers understand that this is a growth, that they are on their hero's journey, that this is a remarkable opportunity to expand oneself, to just be a richer, deeper, broader, exciting person, then fathers begin to start to really embrace what their role is. And they, of course, empathy or compassion is a skill, but that wasn't one of the 10 skills that fathers um, talked about. What they talked about was awareness, is to be aware, to be aware that this woman's body is in constant, 100% of the time, every nanosecond of the time, having to adjust and change to this rapid changes from the first phase, conception of 12 weeks, and from 12 weeks to 24 weeks. So if you imagine from conception to 12 weeks, the uterus has grown, but you can't feel it above the pubic bone. At 12 weeks, you can begin to feel it. By 24 weeks, it's up at the navel. That How rapid is that? So for the first 12 weeks, it didn't feel rapid, and now it's gonna to start to feel more rapid week after week after week. However, she's emotionally having to change and she's metabolically having to push off the waste products of this baby that's growing inside. So when father said, we need skills as men to keep up with the changes that women are experiencing and that the babies experience, they took it in hand as a companion. They knew that they weren't experiencing what the woman was experiencing, but they knew that they couldn't just sit back and let this happen because the more they sat back and became disengaged or befuddled or bewildered, the more the woman became irritable with them. And this eventually results in women saying, I don't want to take care of two children. So women really have a very high expectation that you mature with them. So awareness is one of those skills. So what are you aware of in the second phase? Well, just about everything. You're aware you're aware. And in some ways, just delight about that. You're growing, you're maturing, you're becoming more of a man, you're becoming a richer human being that your child is going to absolutely love. You're filling out this part of you that is uniquely a man, which is the chest, the heart, the love, the embrace, the protection. The, the you know, where do people want to rest with on a man's body? Okay, we we're told that men are ruled by their dicks, but they're not ruled by that. They're ruled by their hearts. Men have big hearts. They want to embrace with their arms and hug to their heart. So when you think about awareness, you want to grow the awareness of how your heart is opening up and expanding. If you have children already, you know that. There aren't you don't stop loving after three. You just keep growing this heart and you embrace everybody. So be aware of this growth in your heart and your willingness to grow and be on this hero's journey. Be aware of the changes in the woman's body. It's delightful and a lot of men would love to be pregnant, but that grows a bit later as well. They didn't want the morning sickness stuff and they're a little confused about this feeling fat versus looking pregnant kind of thing. But once you start to feel the baby move at 22 to 24 weeks and then beyond, you have created this child. So become aware and grow this awareness with this huge pleasure in yourself that you have done this and just keep growing your heart. See you again tomorrow.